bear with me as I do my presentation. <coughs> okay, so good evening, everyone. My name is Neve Lines, and I'm the university recruiter in VMware, and I look after the EMEA region, which is Europe, Middle East, and Africa. So obviously this evening I'm going to be concentrating on our site in Ireland. Um, I don't have that many slides, so if anyone wants to come up and have a chat with me after and ask some specific questions on VMware, feel free to do so. So I suppose just in terms of what I'm going to cover this evening, just a brief overview of who v VMware is and what we do, our opportunities in Ireland, our recruiting timeline, some words of wisdom for your application procedure, and most importantly how to actually apply to VMware. So who is VMware? So maybe a show of hands for people who've heard of VMware. Okay, that's good, that's positive, because um, I think it's indicative of the, con of the company and how we're growing and our brand getting out there. I suppose we wouldn't have been very well known um, kind of over the past few years, but certainly our presence is becoming much more known and we are growing quite rapidly, so it's good to see that you've heard of us. So for those that haven't, um, we're essentially a virtualization company uh, with a global leader in virtualization and cloud infrastructure. So we deliver award-winning customer-proven solutions that accelerate IT by reducing complexity and enabling more flexible, agile service delivery. So we very much own the virtualization space and we are beginning to move into the cloud space as well at the moment. Um, so we have over 11,000 employees uh, globally, I think that's probably over 12,000 by now actually. Um, 3.77 billion in 2011 revenues, we have over 40 locations worldwide and we're the fifth largest infrastructure software company in the world. So um, I guess this slide just gives you a sense of our global presence and obviously this evening I'm going to concentrate on our office in Balancolic. So now I'm just going to show you a very quick YouTube video from some of our leadership in the Cork office just to give you a sense of the culture in VMware and the various functions that we support from the Cork office. So hopefully the YouTube video will be Everything about this company built around doing things differently and doing it quickly. The top two areas that CIOs will spend IT dollars this year are virtualization and cloud computing. VMware owns a virtualization space and is a major player in cloud computing. We've got the most disruptive technology on planet Earth and we're driving new markets, we're creating new ways of thinking and being part of that is hugely enjoyable. Over the past four years we've added about 500 jobs to Cork to take the support Sales. Hello, the employees that work on the core campus are extremely excited to be here, really enthusiastic about working for such a great company with such a great technology. You know, they're highly motivated people. They're fun. Uh, they've been blessed with the core sense of humor. <laughs> <laughs> they push hard to be the best that they can be and be, make our center the best that it can be. It's a culture that constantly evolves and will constantly evolve. Every single day we have something new on the table. Somebody has come up with a new idea and we grab it with both hands. You know, the sky's the limit with regards to opportunities. There's always something new and exciting coming down the pike. No two days are the same. You make the role what it needs to be. Whether it be as an individual contributor or moving into that management um, position. So it's just a great environment, um, very supportive management team, um, just a great place to be. We're very socially responsible as a company. We want to give back more than what we actually take from society. My advice to you would be to search for jobs portal on jobs.vmwork.com and submit a CV. We have an open door policy where it's not always an interview cycle. So if somebody wanted to just come and have a conversation over a cup of coffee, they can come and find out that. But more about VMware. It's a fantastic opportunity. The experience that you get, the learning opportunities, the aha moments you're going to have. I can truly say this is the first time where I love my job uh, every day with a passion. The opportunities are endless uh, because the company is growing so quickly. And it's a really fun, exciting, great place to work. The future certainly looks bright. If you're fortunate enough to receive a job offer from VMware, I would suggest you grab it with both hands. It works well with a Okay, so hopefully that just gave you a quick snapshot of the VMware office and the culture and the fun environment that we have. Um, so just kind of reiterating things that were said in the video there. So we're actually over 700 people out in Balancolic at the moment. And the main functions out there are technical support, IT, finance, legal, sales and HR. Now in terms of graduate opportunities, I would say it's really technical support is where it's all happening. Um, so our global support services function um, based in Balancolic is growing quite rapidly. So we're looking for technical support engineers, um, people from a BIS background, computer science background, 
say a commerce background, if you really love technology and you're passionate about um, technology in your spare time, that's, that's really good as well. So um, it's very much on the infrastructure side of things. We're looking for people with good Linux and Windows skills, networking, troubleshooting, and obviously very good communication skills as well because you'll be dealing with some of our enterprise customers. I suppose very similar to some of the roles that Paul spoke about in EMC as well, um, that the roles in VMware would be quite similar. So in terms of our recruiting timeline, I suppose we're, we're quite different. For the internship roles that we have, um, most of our positions are posted in September. We do the interviewing around now and we extend offers between now and next April. For the new college graduates, or the graduate opportunities, we don't have a structured program like some of the other companies at the moment. Um, I suppose because we're growing so much, we're really just hiring graduates as the opportunities become available. So we don't have one uh, set closing deadline or one set of um, students that will come in and work for us as graduates um, on one particular date. So um, we're hiring basically all year round for, for graduates. So the application process is very much ongoing. So you know, don't, you know if, you, if you're going to be um, graduating shortly, feel free to submit your CV or if you know anyone that has graduated, you can encourage them to apply online. And all the new college graduate roles, they're full-time permanent opportunities as well. So it was just some words of wisdom because you're probably at that time of the year now where you are starting to apply for your graduate opportunities. So I suppose if you do receive a job interview, it's very important to do your interview homework. So, you know, say like Accenture do the competency-based interview. So go away and research what is a competency-based interview. What skills would they be looking for? Um, you know, and really think of specific examples of things you've done in, in the past. Don't answer with kind of general questions, you know, for example, I, I am good at communication, I always communicate well with people, have that one specific example where you can talk through something from beginning to end. Um, spell check your CV, I would say probably one in every two or three CVs that I receive will have some kind of typo or spelling mistake and grammar mistake on it, and that's, that's at all levels, it's not just intern grad, it's up to very experienced levels, so um, make sure you, you know, make, take advantage of the career services on campus and, you know, get them to go through your CV and make sure that there isn't something glaringly um, there that, that you're missing yourself. Speak to VMware employees. Uh, if you don't know someone yourself who knows someone working in VMware, chances are you know, there, there will be kind of that third degree of separation. So make sure you speak to someone in VMware, get their thoughts and get their advice and kind of find out what it is like to work in a company. And um, what I would say as well is be creative with your applications. We love to see people send in, you know, YouTube videos, um, portfolios, links to their websites that they've created themselves. We love to see something different rather than a standard CV come through all the time. And I'll, I'll come back to that in just a moment. So I suppose the all important thing then is how to apply. So um, if you go on to our careers website and go to our university relations page, so vmware.com forward slash careers forward slash you are, and you can upload your details there. Um, you can also just register your details online if there's not a role that you see that's available right now for you but um, you'll just be entering your details into our database then so we can search for your details um, as and when those roles do become available. In addition to that, we're on all the social media platforms, so be sure to connect with us so you'll see our updates when we're on campus and what we're doing. So there are just some of the platforms that we're available at. So I'm just going to finish off if I have, a, do I have a couple of minutes? But, so this is just a two minute clip. Um, I suppose the software I'm using this evening is um, software from one of the companies we acquired recently probably be able to be a year and a half by now, uh, Slide Rocket. So um, one lady sent her application into the Slide Rocket company because she wanted a job at Slide Rocket. Um, so what she did is she um, sent this presentation directly to the chief executive of Slide Rocket, and now she's a very successful product manager with the company. So I just want to kind of close with this so you get an idea of the creative applications that we do receive um, on a quite regular basis these days in VMware. So hopefully it will work.
don't expect all our applications to look like that, but uh, hopefully it will inspire you to, you know, if you are, if you're really passionate about a company, don't be afraid to think outside the box and do something a bit different, because it is quite hard to stand out in, in this marketplace, so don't be afraid to think differently. Um, so that's me done. Thank you very much.